This is a Pentium 4 computer with Windows XP on it, as you see. I'm going to install Linrad on this. Uh, first, I will create a folder to store Linrad in, and I put it directly under C colon here. Right click and uh, new folder. Call it Linrad. Um, then go out on the internet. Uh, to sm5bsz.com This is my home page and here is the link to Linrod and here is the executable for Windows right click on it save it in Linrod uh, Save. Uh, Linrad will also require some DLL files. They are here. So I right click on that and save it in the same place. Uh, the executable is a zip file, it's an archive with a couple of files in it, so we need to uncompress it, and to do that I have to download something, uh, go to 7-zip.org, and uh, download the 32-bit x86. And the computer is protected, so and save this installer at the same place. Save. Close. And so here we have what we need. First, use this seven zip installer. Run it. Install. And now I have to unpack the the uh, packet folder. So go to the start button, start 7-zip. Here, find the file in Linrod here and unpack it. OK. That's it. So now, sorry, uh, here is the Linrad installation. Uh, I create an icon for Linrad by right-clicking this file. Uh, send to desktop, like that. And now if I try to run Linrod here, you see, couldn't find this file. It's a DLL file because I didn't unpack, uh, I didn't run this 
This is an installer. So run it. Install. Finish. And now when I click on this Lindrad icon, here the program has started. Now I just have to do the setup and that will be for another video.